The wind was a torrent of darkness among the gusty trees. The moon was a ghostly galleon tossed upon cloudy seas. The road was a ribbon of moonlight over the purple moor. And the highwaymen came riding, riding, riding. The highwaymen came riding towards the old inn door. He had a French cock hat on his forehead, a bunch of lace at his chin, a coat of the claret velvet and breeches of brown doeskin. They fitted with never a wrinkle. His boots were up to the thigh, and he rode with a jeweled twinkle. His pistol butts a twinkle, his rapier hilt a twinkle, under the jeweled scar. Over the cobbles he clattered and clashed in the dark inn yard. He tapped with his whip on the shutters, but all was locked and bar. He whistled a tune to the window, and who should be waiting there but the landlord's dark-eyed daughter. Bess, the landlord's daughter, plaiting a dark red love knot into her long black hair. And dark in the dark old inn yard, a stable wicket creaked, where Tim, the ostler, listened. His face was white and peaked. His eyes were hollows of madness, his hair like mouldy hay. But he loved the landlord's daughter, the landlord's red-lipped daughter. Dumb as a dog, he listened, and he heard the robber say, You did a good night's work, Tim, but His Majesty's soldiers are close by. Hurry now. 